Hi, I'm Vanessa. I have an awesome testimony to share with you today about how God healed our child. It was in 2008 that we had our third child, Alyssa. She was born with a rare condition called hydrops vitalis cyclothorax. So basically when she came out, the doctors told us to say goodbye. She didn't really have much of a chance. The NICU took five hours to come to our town to pick her up. She had three doctors hand ventilating her as the breathing equipment was broken down. So as she left, when the team came, they said say goodbye. I mean, how do you say goodbye to your little girl? You, you just can't. So anyway, we were believing for God to heal her. We needed a miracle. And pretty awesome thing, our church, as we were at the hospital, our church had a picture of her on the big screen. And they all stood up that day. They were praying for her. They were declaring her healed and that God was going to heal her. And we just heard it was such a powerful um, morning that morning. They all just agreed in faith. So we believe God started the road to her healing that morning. So three weeks went by. We would ask the doctors every day, um, how is she doing? Is she going to survive? And they, they would always tell us they don't know. It's a 50-50 chance. We don't know which way she's going to turn. And with both of her lungs were full of fluid, and the doctors told us that if she only had one lung full of fluid, she had a 50% chance of survival. Like I said, she had both lungs full. And so on the third week, my husband went up in front of the church, and they prayed for him. They prayed for her for healing. And they all just stood again in faith, believing that there's gonna be a turnaround for our little girl. So needless to say, a couple days later, my husband came to visit us at the hospital. We were a few hours away from home. And they started weaning her off of the morphine. They started taking out the IVs. She had seven of them, including in her head and in her feet and all over her little body. So praise God for that miracle. Uh, from then, she started just her road to recovery and to healing. So we were in the hospital for 39 days and we were able to take our little girl home after that. But the, it didn't really stop there because she had had five hemangiomas all over her body. And one was on the top of her head, uh, size of about a baseball, half a baseball. And one was on her liver. So she needed surgery. So they had an ultrasound of the spot on her liver. And what did we do? We took her up to the front of the church again and believed that God was going to heal her, uh, her spot on her liver. So it was really neat because one of the congregation members had a Bible and he just pressed that Bible up against her chest and he just declared her healed and clean in Jesus' name. And a couple days later, we went for her pre-op and the ultrasound technician took another ultrasound and he kept bringing in other nurses and doctors and they were looking at the old one, looking at the new one, and they couldn't find it. So praise God. My husband and I started kind of chuckling to each other because we knew God had did it. He did it again. He healed her again. So if you're needing a healing touch today or a miracle from the Lord, uh, I really believe that God wants to heal you. You're watching this. Um, it's no accident that you're watching this right now. So would you just believe with me? And I'm just going to pray for you that God would heal you. So just bow with me. Lord, God, whoever's watching right now, Father, we just lift them up to you. Uh, right now, Father, we just declare them healed. Just touch them. Heal them. In Jesus' name, we just declare them healed. Thank you, Lord, for washing them clean. In Jesus' name. Awesome. I really believe God wants to heal you or he's healed you already. So praise God uh, for that. Just receive it in Jesus name. Also want to tell you and invite you about some awesome thing happening in our province, June 2nd to 4th. Come together. It's going to be great in Saskatoon. So you can get your tickets um, online at cometogether.day. We'll see you there. It's going to be epic. Thanks for watching.